we invited this faith community to collect funds towards the civil war and unrest in Ethiopia to assist the local church there to actually provide food for people who are in need. What we've heard is that it's difficult for this to occur there because of the unrest and so on, and we want to join them in that work. We have received a letter from one of the people that is on the ground right there in Ethiopia. This is what this person writes to us. Greetings, the meeting place. In the name of our Lord Jesus Christ, our dear brothers and sisters in Christ. Some of the images behind me are part of this story. As you know, in Ethiopia for the last 16 months, the country is passing through difficulties because of the civil war, especially the people in Tigray. They are suffering for this reason. A lot of people are dying, especially elderly people and children, that food is not getting into Tigray. So we humble, uh, humbly ask you to pray for peace and reconciliation for our country to the Lord. Your church giving to us, and because of your beautiful help, we support the needs of 235 people as much as we can. We want to say thank you and God bless you. So that's something that happened at Christmas where we were able to collect funds to support the work there. And so I'm so pleased that we were able to assist them. And so there's a letter for us. Of course, the other thing, this is more recent news, our Easter Compassion Project. We opened up this project much earlier than we typically do because you and I have been watching the circumstances in Ukraine, trying to figure out what we could do about it. And here's the exciting news. At the beginning of last weekend, so Good Friday, we had received about $20,000 worth of donations at that point. Well, this week, you may have received an email from us that gave you our new total. We, by the time the weekend was over and a few days into this week, doubled that amount, and so we have collected towards the efforts of local churches in Ukraine just over $40,000. Isn't that exciting stuff, my friends? I'm so pleased.